This lesson is about addition rules. First, I have to introduce odd and even numbers. After that, I will go into the addition rules. So first, odd and even numbers. What are they? OK, let's get started. 1. 1 is an odd number. And it's represented by one little square. So now a 2 is represented by two squares. And it looks, or it is a rectangle. One square and the second square. So now let's get over to 3. 3, yes, is represented by three squares. 1. Then the 2 is directly underneath. And next to it, the one like a finger pointing out is the number 3. So that's an odd number, always one extra. So 4 is a square, so which is also a rectangle. The 5, again, your square with the finger. And the 6, again, a rectangle. The 7, not a rectangle. And now, number 8, a rectangle. So these are the even and odd numbers. An odd number can be represented by different figures. So this is the first one, and this is the second one. So there's still a 5, and this one as well. So it could be on that side. And the last one. So these are the four possibilities of doing that. OK, let's look at the addition rules. First rule, even plus even equals? Hmm. It's even. So now let's see what that is. So a rectangle, number two, plus another rectangle, in this case four, if you add them up together, what is that equal? So just move the two figures together and you get six. And as you see in the coloring, the two combined have the new rectangle, the six. So the second rule coming now is even plus odd equals odd. So that's the next rule we're looking into. So the first, it's an even number. It's a four, which is your square or rectangle, plus three, which is the odd number. And uh, what is that equaling? Again, moves the two sides together, and you get seven. And in the coloring, you see how that is there. And it's not a rectangle. Therefore, it's an odd number. So the next rule after that is odd plus even. And that equals to odd. OK, now we will see that in the graph. So 3 is the odd number. And we will add an even number to it, which is the number 4. Same as the other example. And what is that equal to? And that equals to 7. And you see that combined, again, it's an odd number. So this 7 looks a little bit different. What if we turn it around? You see here the first turn. After the second turn, it looks like 7 from the last example. And now you can say this is equaling to 4 plus the 3. OK? Now we're back to what we had in the other example, even plus odd. Now we're getting to the last and fourth rule. It's odd plus odd. And odd plus odd equals even. OK, we will see that in a second. The beginning is an odd number. Let's take the 3. And we add another odd number, which is the 5. Now. This we can write a little bit differently. That's the same 3 plus, and now we turn the 5 around a little bit and do that, or mirror it. And so the outcome 3 plus 5 equals 2, and the answer is 8. And now you see that, that now 8 is an even number because it's a rectangle. And this concludes this lesson. Here is an overview of all the four rules for additions. And thank you very much.